The Columbia Museum of Art is really thrilled to present a major exhibition entitled Remix, Themes and Variations in African American Art. And the whole idea of the Remix exhibition is that artists, whether they are painters or musicians or writers, are influenced by the past. They'll take a great song and they'll redo it and they'll mix in a riff from some other song or lyrics from some other piece and you know, mash it up. Visual artists do the same thing and with interesting and exciting results. We've got a big, big show coming up with 45 works of art opening on February 5th. In that show is this wonderful piece right next to me by Kehendi Wiley, who is an artist who's grabbed all kinds of international attention for his interesting work. And what Kehendi does is to take young men and place them in the role formerly held by saints and heroes in the Renaissance. 45 different pieces kind of like this that are reinventing or reimagining or redoing the past. This is going to be a great exhibit. You have to be there. So in the exhibition remix, in addition to artists like Handy Wiley, we've got a terrific piece by an artist named Fahamu Peku out of Atlanta, Georgia. And this should look familiar to a lot of you. It's a redo, a remix of Norman Rockwell's famous painting, his triple self-portrait. Only instead of Norman Rockwell, Fahamu has placed himself at the center. And it's a fabulous way of saying, look, creativity goes on. But not only that, once you have a great image or a great story and it's out there in the culture, it becomes part of our culture. And so retelling that story is what we do. And we add details and we leave out some details and then that story becomes fresh. And we've all done that. This idea of remixing came because it's so prevalent in African American art and we thought, well, great idea for a show. So it really, the, the impetus for bringing the show comes from the desire to always be bringing the most original, creative, high quality art that we possibly can. And art that has sometimes a point of view. There was a time in the museum world when museums did not collect art made by everyone. If you were a woman artist, for example, in America, you might as well fly to the moon. I mean, your chances of getting on a museum wall were almost nil. It took museums a long time to mature and realize that the way to tell the story of American art is to include all American artists. So we have made, when I say we, I mean all museums across the country, coast to coast, have made a conscious effort to show the full extent of the creativity of American artists. That means you've got to show women artists, uh, outsider artists who didn't go to art schools and academies, and you've got to show African-American artists. And so, you know, 50 years ago, the Columbia Museum of Art, quite frankly, wasn't actively collecting African-American art, which means now the silver lining is we have this great opportunity to make up for that and go back and fill out our holdings by prominent African-American artists. So we are actively doing that. We're building that collection and African-American art figures more into our regular schedule than ever before, thus the Remix exhibition. Upstairs we now have a gallery devoted to African-American art. So in terms of exhibitions, being on the wall and being in the collection, African-American art has taken the place that it always should have had inside of the Columbia Museum of Art. It always should have been there. Now it is. And so, you know, we feel great about it. We think this show is exciting. We the stuff that's going on the wall upstairs is exciting. So if you live in Columbia and you want to visit the Columbia Museum of Art, you can expect to see the story of contemporary art and American art being told more fully, more fairly, and quite frankly, it's a lot more fun when everybody is there at the party. So um, we're excited about it. If you've got a Saturday afternoon or a Sunday afternoon and you're thinking about something different to do, maybe there's no football game on that day, the thing about visiting a great art exhibition and visiting the museum in general is that you're in for surprises. You're in to see some art that you don't know and artists that you've never heard of. And why wouldn't you want to do that? Because, you know, the art that you know, that's great. You don't have to give it up or forget it. You can just add these new artists to your repertoire. And the thing about museum professionals is we're in the business of bringing you high quality stuff. And so if you come here to visit Remix, it is a safe bet. You're going to see 45 great works of art. You're going to go home and say, hey, you should see this artist I just discovered today at the CMA. They're fabulous. How come we're not down there all the time? That's a question you need to answer. You need to be down here all the time because we're working for you to bring you the best stuff that we possibly can.